Away from the buzz of the big cities, village life in rural Morocco seems to flow by much as it's done for decades. But the country is changing, and even small communities are noticing the difference. A few kilometers from Marrakesh is the village of Agutim. Electricity poles and meters have appeared. Agutim's 250 residents were recently connected to the national power grid for the very first time. And the biggest changes are being felt at home. Hanan lives here with her family. From cleaning the home to preparing a meal, electricity has revolutionized the way she runs the household. دابا الحمد لله توفرنا على الطاقه الكهربائيه ولات عندنا ثلاجه تلفازه ولينا كنلقاو فين شارجيو التليفون ولينا كنلقاو باش نضويو من قبل ما كانتش عندنا هاد الاشياء كاملها مثلا كنا تنشريو اللحم تتبقى تتات خناز ما كناكلوهاش الا الا فات نهار واحد خصنا نرميوها The electrification of Agoutim is part of an investment program led by ONE the National Office for Electricity and Water it's plugging in more than 1,200 rural villages, even in the most remote areas of the country. The EBRD is backing the program with a 60 million euro loan. كيف ما تشوف ده بالعملية دي الصابون ولا تسهل علينا مش بحال من قبل كنا تصبنوا بالفرقة والبانيو وكان تعبوا بزاف من هاتي يضرونا يدينا تيضرنا ظهرنا ده بالحمد لله كل شيء ولا متوفر كل شيء ولا سهل. Thanks to donor support, there's been a careful assessment of the impact of the project on the environment and on Moroccans themselves. Bringing electricity to those who've had none before opens a world of opportunity that elsewhere is taken for granted. As simple, for example, as being able to charge a mobile phone or do homework after sunset. Up in the Atlas Mountains, work has only just begun. This is the EBRD's first energy infrastructure project in the country. But by the end of it, virtually every Moroccan home will have a source of permanent power. Hanan's is a vision of a brighter future for the next generation in Morocco. And that's a vision shared by the EBRD.